everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Black Blind Nuzlocke Rewind. I don't have a way to continue that sentence. Okay, I only played like a little bit between episodes and it wasn't much. I did a little bit of grinding on uh, on Haxors and on Y. That's about it. I haven't even had the egg uh, hatch yet. And, uh, and as always, I got more stuff that I gotta do after I'm done this recording, so I'm not- So it's, this, this might be a bit of a shorter session, but of course that doesn't matter to you guys. Because you're still getting episodes put out at a regular rate. It just means I record a little bit more often. You rock. I'll give you this heat rock. I don't even know what this did! This, this, this is! Why is it warm? Ah, no. Get out of here. So this is the place where I needed to go. Because I've cleared out the more Vicarus. I caught him on there. Now I have to go through this route. Cobbles! Cobbles, Cobbles! So, I've been traveling, I've been thinking about things, things like what I could do with my life and what I want to do, but uh, I'm thinking how cool it would be to be a model like Alessa. Who is Alessa? And then how cool it would be to do research on Pokemon like Professor Juniper? Who is Professor Juniper? That's what I want to do, I'm going to have to know a lot about Pokemon, so would you please battle me? G where is this coming from? Neither of those things had to do with battling. Why, Bianca? I'm carrying very weak mons right now. <laughs> oh, you have a, a team of four here. <laughs> I'm used to this shit from Sharon, not from you. Ah, 38. Oh, I'm not prepared for this. Not even kind of a little bit. I have a 31 as the first one. Ah! Ah, oh, I'm gonna lose Mons, aren't I? Oh, fuck. I only have five. Only three of them are at an appropriate level for this. If you use a normal move, I could put out Soul Fire, right? If you use a normal move, I can put out Soul Fire. But if you use a dark move to try and sidestep the steel, then that's asking for Soul Fire to be super dead. Haxors is a dragon, which means I can resist the elements, but Esteltland doesn't have elemental moves. You have known fighting stuff, so Cosmoish is out. You know, I don't, I wasn't prepared for this. I don't care. I'm gonna steamroll with Boyd if I must. Get out there, Boyd. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. You stop that. Okay, revenge. Hit me first. No, I need you to hit me. Not work yourself up more. Hit me. Stop trying to hit me and hit me. In fact, it's start trying to hit me. You haven't even attempted it yet. You chose that move. That's right, I did, Bianca, and I'll do it again. Um... Waterfall? No! No! Oh! Okay, thank god I critted. Down goes the stout land. That's one. That's also a lot of experience to go out. Oh, I thought for a half second that might have been the other sage. I mean, the other simi. Alright, that's one item here. Um, I can't leave Boyd out here. This is a good option for Soul Fire, but the problem then becomes, um, when and where do I heal Boyd when, for when I need him next, because I know I'm going to need him again. Don't you dare, don't you, okay. Oh, uh, what? Fuck off with your not very effective. That destroyed me. If you're mostly physical, then I'm going to pray that will -O will do something. Can you not? Can you stop? Good news is, if that's what he's gonna keep using, I know that's not gonna do it. Also, I didn't actually use an item. But if, if... Now I know how much a critical will do. So as long as I keep above that health amount, he should never be able to kill me. Now that he's, uh, poisoned, it'll also be significantly easier. I mean, not, not poisoned, burned. Because A, he should be doing less damage, and B, even if I heal, it's hurting him. See, bombs a physical, right? It looks like it. Wonderful. Oh, this is a wonderful opportunity too, because now I can uh, now I can use the energy root. Is that what I'm after? Energy root on Boyd. That gets Boyd topped up. That is two items. Don't lower my defenses. Don't lower. No, it's not allowed. You stop that. Stop that. I'm gonna have to burn you now. Flame burst.
It's not as much damage as I've been hoping for. Bianca, Bianca, Bianca! Oh boy, now I have lower defenses. Okay, the critical shouldn't care about lower defenses, so I still know a crit isn't gonna kill me. I think. Okay. Well, Will O Wisp you again. Not so stoked about using three items on the first two mons, but the good news. One of them was to get my starter completely healed back up again. Not Pokeballs. I can't catch the thing, as much as I would love to steal it from her. I'd love it if I had something for 60 HP instead of 50 or 200. But I think the 60s are things that you just sort of like... They're, they're, they're like fresh waters. You have to specifically go out and buy those. That's a third item, all right. Okay, please, please stop. Please stop resisting. Don't get, a, you know, even if I get them almost dead again and then she full restores again, I'm still not too pissed because it didn't happen, but that would mean that I've pulled out both of her full restores, which is good news. Not so good that I'm getting her to use them at all, but like that I can bait them out. That's the starter right there. That's a big boy. It's a big pig. Level 40. I don't like the big pig at level 40. Good news. Void is all refreshed and ready to come in and drench the thing in waterfalls and then surf on the waterfalls. Oh, Assurance is a dark move. That's why you did it. You were trying to get at my ghost side. Mmm. Mm -hmm. I know your... I know your plots. I know your plans. Waterfall might make him flinch, but Surf is the overall more powerful move. What are Boyd's stats looking like right now? Surf is the overall more powerful move, but I have higher attack by more than 15 points. Which is about the difference here, so then it comes down to which one are you weaker against? Special or physical moves, and I have no gosh darned idea. I'm gonna go with the waterfall and hope I'm faster so that I get flinch chances. Nope, no go. Then I guess I swap to surfs. Or I could just kill you in one shot! I am okay with this as well! Musharna. Oh, this thing. This thing that I could have had. Hello. How are you? I know that thing is supposed to be smoke, but once it was pointed out to me, I can't... I, I struggle to not see it as an umbilical cord. It looks like a fetus. So you're psychic. You're pretty defensive. I think ghosts are supposed to be anti-psychic, aren't they? I would like to just leave Boyd out. All right, if, if I need to, I'll swap back to Boyd. I'm gonna try Soul Fire. I don't imagine you're very physically beefy, but a burn would at least... Yeah, you know what? Let's just go straight Shadow Ball. Test the theory. This is a special move, so it should cut through. Aha, uh -huh, super effective. Ooh. Ghost on Psychic, I had marked down. All right, if I can get away with using it three times, it should work. That's good. You blew one on a, on a defense move. You blew one on a hypnosis that didn't land. Every time I watch my Pokemon battle, it ends like this. Oh, oh, that's sad. Bianca, no. I don't want to make you hurt. I'm sorry you suck as a trainer. But if I if, if my mons die, I lose. If, if I lose, my mons die. I'm fighting for actual, literal survival here. Good news. I did it. I've made it through Bianca. 
the world-renowned wall that she is. Hey, Haxor got a level. Taunt? Why would I ever learn Taunt? Taunt is like, hey, just keep attacking me. That's terrible. No. God, no. <laughs> Give up on Taunt. Okay, the Pokemon of both sides tried so hard, didn't they? That's right, you did. You actually made me scared for a minute. And this makes me want to give this to you. Mwah! Bianca, that was on my eye. In Castellia City, my precious Pokemon was stolen by Team Plasma, so I really, really understand. If Team Plasma forces everyone to liberate their Pokemon, there will be nothing but sad people. Lots of happy Pokemon, but sad people. Don't allow Pokemon to be stolen from traders alone. If I think that's the truth, or anything to you that you've been pursuing, I don't know. You never actually say anything. Oh dear, hair have come all this way. I'm afraid I'm bothering you and you're trying to go through so much. All I want is to help you relax. You'll totally be fine. I guarantee it. You know what I mean, so bye. <laughs> Sometimes I feel like Bianca doesn't know what she wants to say and she just lets her mouth ramble for a while. I relate. How do I describe this? You know that vibration you feel on the soles of your feet when you're crossing the tube line bridge? It's the coolest. No, I don't. It's a fictional bridge. For anyone obsessed with railroads, the tube line bridge and Anvil Town are both perfect spots for pictures. And a giant steel bridge. I get excited just looking at this model. Oh, big bridge. Big bridge, ye say. Hmm. So, Haxors... He's at level 36. I think that might be high enough to, like, get away with fighting wild battles again. We'll have to see. Hey, you, it's just my opinion, but it's best if you avoid this area on weekend evenings. The brats who live around here often get up to something stupid. Gotcha. Wait, it's 4.30 p.m. on a Sunday. Oh, God, I'm going to get ambushed by brats, aren't I? Will you stop walking away from me? D stop, 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 stop. What? Stop. When I was running around trying to outrun the trains, I got overheated. Anyway, please take this. See? Don't hold out on me. This TM contains Flame Charge. You'll blow by everyone. Flame Charge is a pretty decent move. I like that move. Who are you? Oh, wonderful. It's you. Come. Gets us. We brought the one you wanted. <laughs> Excellent, it seems you have to hand the lightstone. I congratulate you on a job well done. It is my lord Ends thought that the two holders of the legendary Pokemon should put their beliefs in the line and strive to find which is the truth. Uh, this is not necessary for his infancy. I provided him with the education required to become the hero of legend. He's been so acknowledged by the legendary Pokemon. Such purity of purpose is his. The liberation of Pokemon, of which Team Plasma speaks, is the separation of Pokemon from foolish people. That's the truth. All trainers will become helpless to resist us. We alone will be able to use them. Great, so you're not even talking about freeing them. You're talking about everybody except for us will be, will not be able to use them. Fuck you! Fuck you, you hypocrites! When my perfect plan is set in motion, first a few gullible Pokemon trainers who are unable to resist Team Plasma will release, then the number will become 100, then 1,000. In no time, even the gym leaders and the champion will become unable to fight us. Even that, that, that... But no, because the gym leaders and the champions are not reliant on the strength of love and happiness and other people for the levels of their Pokemon. Like, the fact that other people release their Pokemon doesn't mean that the gym leaders will just become weaker? I don't think that really lines up. Having a Pokemon will be considered a bad thing. Even people who just, like, the sad little Bianca whose Pokemon was stolen will be unable to face public opinion and will release their Pokemon. That's the kind of world we'll make. You may have the stone, but there's no chance whatsoever the legendary Pokemon accept as a hero. So if you're not willing to hand them over, I suggest we search for some courage because you're going to need it. Dude, I'm just walking forward because the road is here. I don't I, I don't know what you're talking about with your world domination plans and all kinds of dumb stuff like that. I tried a little too hard. I bought way too much. And Route 9 has a lot of trainers for such a short route. If there's a place where the people can ride, similar people tend to gather together. Ooh, trainers, you say. 
I'm down for some trainer fights. Pitcher throws the first pitch. Kubel's obtained TM56 fling. You, th why do you, why? Why did you throw this at me? What I just threw is TM56 fling. You throw an item to damage the target and the damage changes depending on what you throw. Terrible move, never, because it, it gets rid of your items. I would never, I will not. What do you got for me, Route 9? Hit me with your trainers. Ooh. What is this music? If I win, give me your Pokemon. I know, I didn't agree to this. We need a verbal agreement, a, 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 a non-spoken contract. Not just, I say this, now go. Steel versus dark and ground. Pretty sure that the ground is gonna be super effective. Yes, all right, so this is dangerous. I think it's ground v ice that's good. And ground v fire is also good. Oh God, why? I have nothing that, like not nothing, I have Boyd. But most of my team can't really stand up to this dude. Haxors? Can you do anything to him? Without dying? All right, well, you were already gonna be faster than me, so that doesn't affect me much at all. What do you do with the Dragon Claw right out the gate? What's the damage look like? I love that move, that animation. It just looks like he's tearing through reality. Okay, good job to Haxors. <laughs> just one-shotting that dude. And we got a Garbodor. Poison? Poison probably has nothing to do with Dragon as far as I'm aware. I don't want speed, and the attack boost probably isn't worth it, so just go for Dragon Claws again, see what happens. Yeet, yeet, yeet. All right, I'll swap, I'll swap. I got your message, loud and clear. Defense fell, speed rose. Okay, cool, so you'll take more damage now. What do I have that'll do well against poison? I don't think poison will work on Agent K at all. So it's a lower level, but maybe I can get away with immunity if you don't have any other moves. Because that's two moves that are just poison. Body Slam? Okay, Body Slam is not very effective against Steel. I might be able to do this. Oh boy. I think it also has a tendency to uh, paralyze or, yeah, and it's not even a guaranteed special attack raise. It has a tendency to either paralyze or flinch me. Body Slam, I think. You're gonna body slam again, which means that Soulfire has a free move. And then I don't think your poison's gonna be particularly scary, and which gives me like a turn to fire blast or to fire whatever the move is. Flame burst. Okay, good. I think that means that poison against ghost is not very effective. I didn't have that marked down yet. Wonderful. I beat him. Woo! That was just a joke. You didn't have to take it so seriously. Dude, I have no way of believing that. Maybe you were gonna take my mons from me. I haven't fallen so low I'd steal somebody's Pokemon like Team Plasma. I believe that. Vending machine. Oh, yes. Fresh waters. Although I have to do this one at a time. It sucks. Just let me buy a bunch. Just... This sucks. No. God, no. Um. All right, well, since I'm tight on time today, I'm gonna call this one a dunzo right at the 21 minute mark. Maybe the next one will run a little long. Depends if I'm in the middle of something when an op when a episode starts. Thank you everybody for watching. The buttons are below, hit them. By now, I feel like anybody you watch on YouTube must have explained to you how much that type of interaction helps. And uh, then we'll see you in the next one where I'm going to beat down this particular guy for his lunch money. He did not hide it in the trash. That's, uh, that's unfortunate. <laughs>